I've always loved the ocean ever since I was a little kid. I can't live more than several kilometers inland from the sea or I start to get really twitchy. Coral reefs in Fiji and in the Western Pacific are in grave danger. They're threatened by many factors. On a local level, this is due to actions like overfishing, threats from the land, and of course, everything is threatened by the overarching threat of climate change. The coral reefs in Fiji and the broader Western Pacific form the fabric of the daily lives for millions and millions of coastal residents. Locally managed marine areas simply refers to an area of reef and its adjacent waters that are managed by local people who are able to control what activities happen in those areas. My work has been mostly involving working with local communities to help them design management practices and strategies that are tailored to their needs locally. When management is effective, when communities have come together and they're implementing their management strategies, we've seen increases in the amount of fish that people can eat, increase in the amount of invertebrates. We've seen increases in the size of fish, which means that they're able to reproduce thousands and thousands of more larvae. The locally managed marine area network has grown from one community active in the late 1990s to now over a thousand communities in the broader Western Pacific. Everyone will be affected by sustainable coastal conservation in the future. The world has become globalized. So it's not just the communities that we're thinking about in Fiji when we implement these projects, it's also how it impacts the entire world. We'll have people that have enough to eat that are able to earn a sufficient livelihood just by being close to the marine environment. We'll have a wider community that appreciates the enormous biodiversity of the sea and appreciates the fact that it will be there for their children to see in the next generation. <laughs>